I'm sitting here with Jen Cody. Jen, stand up. <laughs> I'm kidding. Annie. <laughs> Any, really? I'm starting with a winner. I'm doing this. I'm doing I know, this. for free and right. stuff. But we're promoting a good cause. Jen is yet again a lead dancer for Broadway Bears. Last year, she sent up uh, an email out to try to get us all to donate to her. She was like, what is it? Like, I don't, I don't this, I don't that. Uh, yeah, I said, I don't, um, I don't ever ask you to do benefits. I don't ever ask you to work for free, but I'm stripping and I need your cash. Well, it's actually all I do is strip. That's yeah. what I like. It was so general. All I do <laughs> is strip. So she's stripping for and Broadway Bears. And raised $11,000 last year. That an awful Broadway Cares Equity Fights Age. Yes. How much off the top here? Anyway, tell everybody what is so great about Broadway Bears. Go. Uh, well, hopefully this year it, we will raise over a million dollars. That's our goal. But why do I want to actually watch it? Uh, well, hot people taking their clothes off. A lot of numbers really funny this year, which I like. Um, Josh Rhodes is directing. Oh, he's hilarious. So we've gone back to old school where all the numbers kind of are funny. Burlesque. And yeah, more burlesque and less just gratuitous grinding. Who am I going to get to see on the nude side? Um, well, there's a lot of youngins. I have to tell you. New ya. generation. I don't know the new people. They look really good naked, though. I mean. Daisy Egan. Oh wait, she's she's, <laughs> she, she's not young anymore I, at all. I'm old school. People. <laughs> You're old school. Okay, yeah. go. Um, um, any good story about Bobby Bears? That would be terrible. <laughs> That's like a joke on two levels. I exactly. Apologize. It's a little salad joke. We'll get to that in a minute. Okay, go. Bobby Bears. Any scandals I need to know about? Any um, mishaps. Favorite mishap was when they did the shaving cream number. I don't know if you remember that. A long the, time ago. Wasn't it like a barbershop? Oh, yeah. It was a barbershop, and they used shaving cream on their genitals. Um, it seemed proper genitals, and um, didn't practice in the lights. And for show, lights went on, whipped cream, or shaving cream melted. Wait! It was awesome. You, know, you weren't there. Just wait. penises. Like, wait till the reveal. And the choreography had their hands back here, so the guys, as they realized it, just kept looking down, and there was nothing they could do. I need to make sure that story is true. Do you have a DVD? Talk to me I privately. I okay. <laughs> okay um, Jen Cody also is a little Sally in all the hilarious Easter bonnets. She writes all the material with her husband, Hunter Foster. They've been together for how many years now? 17. They met during and segued into what was worse. Anywho, the point is. <laughs> well, we're the good grace now. Oh, you're right. <laughs> Our revival is now the amazing revival. Anywho, um, and also with David Beach. So, but a lot of times Jen gets busted by Broadway Cares. Like, you may not say that you should it, it's too mean. And then Jen and I worked on the Rosie Variety Show. Remember that? That we thought we were going to have jobs for like a lot of years and stuff, uh, and it kind of lasted up yeah. night. It's all good. Nice. Anywho, um, it was right after Rosie did Known on the Net, and she had that big tap number, and she like took five classes. She's like, I can tap. She did a big <laughs> tap number, and then Jen had a joke as a little Sally, and it was it was kiboshed from the Rosie Variety Show. So I thought she'd finally get a chance to do it for a camera. What was the joke they did they did not allow? They actually cut me saying, I think they should spend less time keeping lesbians from having babies and more time keeping them from tap dancing. <laughs> It's better when I have the brains and the But it's bear. still a bra like, It's Okay, anyway. and it's always really fun to be in an Easter Bonnet competition with your mom, and you're sitting there enjoying the, probably the warm Broadway community, and you hear this out of Jen's mouth. I'll be Officer Lockstock, I'm in the audience. Little Sally, do you think I'm overexposed? Well, on a scale of one to Seth Rudetsky, no, I think you're okay. It hurt, and I'm angry. Take care. <laughs>